Uh, I'm going to be presenting on uh, some of the work that I'm doing for my PhD at Stellenbosch University, with Dr. Elke Crouch. So uh, our topic is factors influencing browning types of which apples explored by means of X-ray computer tomography. Uh, Fuji is an important apple cultivar in South Africa. Uh, it originated from Japan in the 1950s. Uh, the long-term storage of Fuji is limited by, by the incidence of internal browning. Uh, internal browning is characterized by patches of brown soldier flesh, possibly with cavities that develop in the internal apple tissue. Uh, so for our first trial, we were looking at the storage regimes and trying to determine uh, which storage regime results in the highest incidence of internal browning. Uh, so basically we had three treatments, which was the regular atmosphere, the controlled atmosphere, and the delayed controlled atmosphere treatment. Uh, we had six months of cold storage. We also had a four weeks uh, uh, period of uh, RA after the, after the cold storage, and then a shelf life period of, of uh, seven days. So uh, for my results for this trial, I'm only going to focus on the internal browning because of my time. Uh, as you can see, the, uh, the incidence of internal browning was, uh, was high in the regular atmosphere uh, fruit. Uh, and it was lowest in the controlled atmosphere fruit. The delayed controlled atmosphere fruit also had a significantly high uh, incidence, of, incidence of internal browning. And uh, this, was, this was quite unexpected, as uh, in literature you would, you would see that uh, delayed controlled atmosphere is expected to reduce the incidence of internal browning, but this was not the case in our, in our studies. Uh, the other part of our study involves uh, X-ray CT scanning. So I'm just going to quickly go through the methodology that we used. Uh, we harvested our fruit from Vacastrum Farm, and the fruit was subjected to 50% carbon dioxide for three days after harvest. Uh, and after that, we did our evaluations and we selected 20 fruit with internal browning and 20 fruit without internal browning. And this fruit were, uh, were, were scanned with micro CT. And after that, we took a sample from each of these uh, apples and we did uh, nano CT scans on these apples. Uh, for our results, I'm only, I'm, I'm only going to look at two parameters, which is the porosity and the Euler number. Uh, these parameters are important because they really affect the way in which uh, gaseous exchange uh, occurs within a fruit. And it, it, it affects the respiration rates and then it affects uh, uh, the incidence of internal browning. So porosity is basically the, uh, the, the volume of the pores that is, uh, that is present in the, in the apple tissue. And the Euler number, it, uh, it represents the connectivity of the pores and it, it affects the way in which oxygen and carbon dioxide moves in and out of the fruit. So we took uh, tissues, uh, some tissue from uh, affected regions of the fruit. These are, these are the brown affected tissue. And then we had uh, non-brown tissue from affected fruit. And we had non-brown non tissue from unaffected fruit. Uh, and as you can see from our results, the brown affected tissue had, uh, had, a, had a very low porosity. And uh, if you look, uh, if you look at, at this diagram, you can see that the, brown, the porosity of the brown tissue is very low and uh, the porosity of the non-brown tissue is very high. So these, uh, these small uh, colored dots represent the pores. And uh, the pores in the same color are connected, whilst those in, in different colors are not connected. So uh, we, we found that browning really affects the, the porosity and the pore structure of tissue uh, in apples. And this in turn uh, causes the, 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 the apples to undergo anaerobic respiration, which causes uh, membrane damage and the onset of uh, and proliferation of internal browning. Uh, and we also saw that for the non-affected tissues, the, the porosity was a bit high. And the, and the, the Euler number, if it's high, it means that the connectivity is, is low. And if it's low, it means the connectivity is high. So uh, it's clear that uh, browning affects the structure of the pores and the connectivity of the pores, which in turn affects the uh, respiration and metabolism within the fruit. For overall conclusions, uh, we found that delayed establishment of CA uh, storage for three weeks is too long and leads to increased uh, core type, core flush type of browning in Fuji apples. And extended storage of Fuji apples under RA conditions also increases in uh, browning incidence. We also found that Fuji is sensitive to high carbon dioxide concentrations. Uh, this is probably due to the lower porosity and the use of perforated bags for packaging might help reduce this problem. 
Uh, the reason why Fuji may is sensitive to internal browning may be because it has small intercellular spaces as compared to other apple cultivars. I uh, also found that X-ray CT uh, is, very, is a very useful technique in evaluating the microstructure of fruit uh, since it provides micro, micrometer resolution to quantitative, quantitatively analyze and characterize apple tissue. Uh, thank you.